Hello tout le monde, c'est Lélé. Donc aujourd'hui on se retrouve pour un nouvel épisode sur Life is Strange. Euh, on devait partir de la maison et aller en cours il me semble. Donc on va continuer ça tout de suite. Donc j'espère que, que vous allez bien et tout ça. Moi ça va super. Surtout quand il s'agit de Life is Strange. Voilà. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that going to prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything for his sake. <sighs> okay, we're free. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. Ok. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shitballs. Ok, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby <laughs> snack to distract his mangy. On va dire que j'ai compris. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Oh merde, je me sais pas. Coucou Maxine, c'est ton papa, désolé de ne pas t'avoir contacté plus tôt. Je sais que tu dois être sous le choc, mais maman et moi, on sait que tu as fait ton possible pour sauver cette jeune fille. Parfois, il y a des choses qu'on ne peut pas contrôler dans la vie. Si tu as envie de rentrer à la maison, te mettre au vert et t'inscrire dans un autre lycée, la porte est grande ouverte. Bisous papa. Merci papa, c'était super dur, mais je ne suis pas prête à rentrer à la maison. A plus, Max. Oh. Bon. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. Okay, she will. Alors ok, officiellement c'est complet, mais j'ai réussi à mettre la main sur deux billets pour nous. J'ai dû me battre avec une dizaine de mecs, c'est nerd. Ok, nickel. I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. Okay, c'était pas bon signe. Frank Bauer stars in A Face Full of Beans. You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing up like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. What the fuck do you want? Take a picture of me and I'll break your fucking camera. How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. You're lucky I just took that gun from you. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even so name it, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ça marche pas. Putain. Qu'est-ce que je peux faire Flic. How you doing, Maxine I'm so sorry you had to be up there with Kate when she, you know, just know that we're proud of you for going up there. Thanks, Officer Barry. 
I know you guys deal with this stuff way more than me, but it is hard to deal with. I'm glad you're representing Black Bull Academy. I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. Such a waste. You're awful. I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but he's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, and then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Okay. What can I do for you, Max? Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. It makes me sick thinking about it. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. What the fuck now? David Madsen is looking for that gun. He might show up on your RV step. Oh, I'm trembling. I don't need to take his little museum piece. Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother. But I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. Il faut que je trouve des informations en fait à parler avec eux. Ah, Nathan, MDR. Je peux rigoler ou pas? Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh... Oh look, Max Amber. Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you tweed bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Kate Marsh. I bet you hoped that Kate Marsh would stay quiet. Idiot says what? Did you drug her? You are so stupid, Max. You think you're so goddamn smart too. Don't push me, girl. You don't want me for an enemy, understand? Do you? Calm down, dude. We're in a diner. Right. Plus, you're an adult now. I can sue your dumbass for libel. Thanks. Now fuck off, Dyke. Mm, holy shit. What do you want now? I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. Mm, holy shit, what do you want now? Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Holy sh... Your sugar daddy will always protect you. And threaten me. You don't know shit about my father or me. Nobody here does. Then tell me what I should know. Why? So you can pretend to care, hmm? Spoiler alert, he's an asshole. Maybe I could help you. I don't... You killed Kate. Maybe we all did. Excuse me. Shit. 
What are the other signs then? We'll chat later, Max. How you doing, Maxine? Uh, Thanks, Officer Barrett. I'm glad you're... Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell with Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. And to his credit, he had a revelation. He <laughs> saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? What can I do for you? Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. David Mac. Oh, I'm. She'll sorry. You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. The magic keys to Frank's RV kingdom. My work here is done here, Frank. You eat like a pig. No, I can't. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. Build. <coughs> he brought. Now back to Chloe. Ah, merde. D'accord, ok, j'avais pas compris. Ok, d'accord, je viens de comprendre, putain. De rien. <rire> moi, je suis comme ça, moi. 
Careful, Max. Cujo ahead. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Brain. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set. Throw! Mais pas, pourquoi je dis ça le je dis sur le parking Get the treat treat boy. I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. Oh, that's Attendez. not waste time. Attendez, je vais tester sur la route the pour. Is busy now, but he might come back. Et s'il va sur la route euh... S'il va sur la route, euh, il va mourir. Moi, je veux pas qu'il meure. Attendez, on va tester. Get the treat treat boy. The meat is in the street. Oh no! Please, please do not let that poor dog be hit. I bet he's fine. I'm sure he is. Come on, we definitely don't have time to waste now. Oh please, please don't let that dog be hurt. Or worse. I don't want to go that way. Ouais, bah, tu sais quoi, euh, non. <rire> Moi, euh, parce qu'on aura encore plus d'ennuis. Parce que là, s'il voit qu'il a perdu son chien, en plus, euh, les chiens, voilà. Moi, je veux pas qu'il meure, les chiens. Moi, je suis comme ça. Donc, voilà. Je suis sur le parking. Get the treat, treat, boy. I think we... Voilà. Damn. Bon, la prochaine fois on verra euh, ce qui va se passer et tout. Euh, dans le camping-car, qu'est-ce qu'on va trouver Je ne sais pas. On verra la prochaine fois. Donc, en tout cas, d'ici là, prenez soin de vous. Et puis, euh, n'hésitez pas à commenter, à partager et à mettre des pouces bleus. Bye bye